Oh boy! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is a early one this morning. Now today, if you can't tell behind me, we're going to West Virginia. Yes, we're going all the way from North Carolina up to West Virginia. We gotta pull Aris on the trailer and the X3, of course. We gotta go to Hatfield McCoy Trails. It's gonna be absolutely sick. We got a house up there. It's gonna be a great time. Christian dog, what are you thinking? I'm ready. You ready? I'm ready to rip, baby. Landon, Polaris guy. What you ready, dude? I'm ready. You ready? I'm ready. It's about to be one badass trip. You guys haven't seen me take the X3 to West Virginia yet. I've been multiple times at Hatfield McCoy Trails with dirt bikes, probably six or seven times, but I've never took a side by side, and that's what everybody takes. We got the truck loaded down, so let's hop in it and roll, baby. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have made it. Y'all ready to rip? So here's our house. I'll definitely have to go give you guys a tour because I haven't even seen it yet. Woo so here's home. Christian, what you think? Here's home for the weekend. Let's check her out. Oh, yeah. What is it? We got a Blackstone? A little griddle type thing? Freezer, dude. Refrigerator. Oh, shit. <laughs> Already breaking shit. <laughs> I gotta find my bed. I'm calling this one right here. Holy shit, there's a living room. This house is like designed so weird. Bro, there's a there's an upstairs. Let's go upstairs and see what it is up here. Damn, there's a lot of beds. Holy crap, <laughs> son. Oh, They're more over here. No shot. Another bathroom, dude. Dude, that no looks way. scary. <laughs> you wanna go down in the basement? I guess so. Let's do it. What in the hell, dude? What this is in rough. The crap? Yeah, it smells like mold down here. Hundred <laughs> percent. We're in here fucking somebody walking down here tonight. Bro, I, that's why we're keeping it locked. Oh, boys, we got everything into the house. And it is time to rip, baby. We got one, two, three X3s, two Razors. But before we go rip, I got to show you guys something. I'm so excited to finally announce. We are launching a new merch drop. BP Outdoors, baby. So here's one of the hoodies. Here's one of the shirts. Check out that hat, dude. And we even brung out a flannel. You know, BP Outdoors, nice fall weather. Check it out. Leather patch and all. Now, I'm super hyped about this merch drop. It looks so good. If you guys want to pick them up first link in the description and you better get it fast because whenever we launched the happy hour merch drop we sold out in six hours now there's a lot more than this on the website but that is actually all i packed with me to west virginia we got some other shirts some other hoodies different colors y'all just gotta go check it out so without further ado let's go ahead hop in the x3 baby and go explore west virginia oh baby christian you better hold on to that camera today we're gonna send this son of a gun off a damn mountain oh uh, you better not <laughs> West Virginia, man. So I used to ride here back when I was younger, back when I used to ride dirt bikes. Me and dad would come up here. I've probably been up here six, seven times and uh, I've never took it a side by side. We got three X3s, two Razors. It's about to be a hell of a day. Oh, and we're riding on the road. It is legal to ride on the road in West Virginia with any machine, any off-road machine for $50 a year. And they got all these public trailheads. The whole state is a riding park. Absolutely insane. Let's get it, baby. There's so much to unpack to you guys because it is like West Virginia. It's a whole nother ball. Game. I know a lot of y'all are coming from the mud community. There's not mud up here. And West Virginia, it is a different animal. Road ride, look at the view. <laughs> Road ride and X3s through crazy stuff like that. Absolutely insane. There's so much to talk about. I'm just going to hop in here and there and talk to you guys while we're riding because this is about to be one hell of a day. And this is about to be one good ass video, son. West Virginia, it's actually a coal mine state. And that's what these trucks are doing is they're coming in here and uh, getting coal out. At least that's what I'm thinking. But you got to be careful. These roads, they're so windy. I guess we're coming up on a trailhead down here and it's going to take us into this insane trail system and hopefully nobody gets lost or breaks anything. Oh my gosh. What up, pimp? <laughs> Just out here cruising on a stroller. I don't even know what they call those things. Yeah, a, a, a scooter? A scooter, that's it. Yeah. Old man scooter pooter. It's so cool being able to ride from the house to the trails. Absolutely love it. We should be coming up on the trailhead somewhere up here, I'm hoping. It looks like we're kind of getting into some backcountry, but that's kind of all of West Virginia. <laughs> oh my gosh. Who is ripping these roads, dude? This must be a trailhead down here. Look at the limited. All right, so here's the trailhead, people. Trail 30, Warrior Trail System. All right. All these are two ways, so you do got to be careful. Let's see. We're starting the weekend with 469 miles. Let's see how many miles we put on this bad boy. We got today, which is Friday. We just got down here today, and then we got tomorrow, which we're ripping sun up to sundown. 
town. It's gonna be so fun, man. So many trails to cover. Ow, it's got hit in the nipple with a rock. Oh, and it's hard. <laughs> it was about a good four hour drive to the bottom side of West Virginia, where we're at. Normally I go to the top side, which is about eight hours. Man, it only been four hours. I can start doing this more often. I mean, we're literally in the mountains, man. Look at this view, bro. This is so sick. Definitely a lot different than mud riding, but it is well worth it. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Bro, I feel like a rock's gonna hit me in my mouth while I'm laughing, and it's just gonna take out a tooth. <laughs> That's scary. The fall vibes are so real. I love it. Oh, bro, these trails are sick. Look at the drop off. Oh my gosh. You do not want to run off the trail here. I'm hoping today we can get into some like cool hill climbs and stuff because that would be so sick. I've never hill climbed the X3, but man, these things are unstoppable. Like these machines will climb up damn near anything. <laughs> Oh my goodness. We locked her down. That was full braking power. The only parts I broke for the X3 was a spare belt. So uh, hopefully it doesn't let me down this weekend. We got a lot of miles to cover. Mile check, 473, baby. We'll probably do about 100 miles today only. And then tomorrow we'll probably do 200. Oh man, oh my gosh. Hello. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at these leaves coming through here. I feel like I'm a choke on one. So like you guys seen earlier that I showed you some of the merchandise, we came out with a new outdoor drop. And it is absolutely fire. If you guys want to go check it out, first link in the description. You guys absolutely destroyed. I mean destroy the happy hour merch. Literally sold out within six hours. So if you want to get on this drop before it sells out, I highly recommend getting on it ASAP Rocky. It's some fire stuff. That flannel, dude, I wanted to wear it all day today. But when we actually got here, it was warmer here at a higher elevation than it was at home. It was so weird. Woohoo! Ow. You good? Yeah. Collarbone? Rock hit me in the chest. That sucks. Almost didn't wear a fucking roost deflector. <laughs> Bring out the chest protector. Hell yeah, brother. We're hauling so much ass, I can't look at the scenery. Ow. Fucking balls. Did you see that? No. My knuckle's gonna be purple. That rock got my ass. Ow. <laughs> I can't see. I can't see shit. Oh shit. Hello. Some slow stuff would be interesting. Is it steep or something? What are we doing? Oh shit. This is kind of steep. Hell yeah. It's time for the fun stuff, baby. Actual trail riding out here. We ain't on no roads anymore. We're going to find way steeper stuff than this here soon. We're doing this in two wheel drive. We need something steeper. As long as we keep our momentum, two wheel drive's fine, baby. I know this probably looks like, oh my gosh, we're going straight up. I know this probably doesn't look like nothing on the GoPro, but uh, holy shit. One thing about a Razor, man, you can see your surroundings a lot better out of that's what i've heard yeah it's, it's very true oh shit we're gonna at least put it in four-wheel drive yeah we needed four-wheel drive for this one listen to that blow-off valve work holy shit oh my gosh we're in two-wheel drive again too Woo! holy shit all right we're finding the shit now baby oh my goodness we are rock crawling now going up these switchbacks they are steep as shit man i like I wish I had an elevation chart to show you guys how fast we go up and how quick we go down. I mean, it is insane. Bro, this is so steep. I think we're, we're increasing the top of this mountain right now. Yeah, we must be going back down now. Oh my, wow. We need engine braking. Hey, this is literally in neutral. Oh shit, he's backing down. Uh, my X3 is overheating and I don't know why. Oh, it can't, it's coming back down. I don't know what's causing it. My fan must not be blowing. I don't know why all of a sudden it's overheating. Hey, hey, hey. Yo! My X3 is overheating. Oh, it's all the leaves. No, leaves sucked into the radiator. No, it don't matter if we're mudding or what we're doing, dude. It's always something. Yeah, you got leaves on the front of his radiator. We gotta watch these radiators. They're getting clogged. The grills are getting clogged with leaves. I'm gonna assume that did the trick. All right, let's roll. Land a new lead. Go, Polaris. Yeah, we're sitting at 199 now. Strange, man. I've had a lot of overheating issues with this thing. If it's not one thing, it's another. Well, at least it ain't gonna catch on fire like the old Polaris here. Oh, I wanna hit that fast. Why is he slowing down for it? Country roads take me home to the place I belong, West Virginia. Take me home. Oh, 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 holy 
Holy shit, dude! He just shit his fucking pants! Oh my gosh! Oh crap! <laughs> At Durham Town, one thing. In West Virginia, you just keep on going right off a mountain, dude. Because whenever that happens, you can't brake hard or you're gonna roll over. So you gotta let off the brakes. And if you're going off a mountain, you're going off a mountain. <laughs> All these trails are two ways, so you gotta really watch it. Not the safest thing in the world. I wanna go up one of these hills, dude. Look at that shit. Straight up. I'm breaking my neck looking up that way. I feel like we need to go down some like hard trails. Like this is fun and all, but you can't go too fast because they're two ways. We need to find some like goat trails that are just like impossible. Ah! What, are you good? I got something in my eye. How? Ah! <laughs> you got coggles on, fool. There ain't nothing funner than just ripping an X3, dude. Absolute ball. Well, that must have been the end of this trail system. Is this where we came in at? Hey, let's hit some harder stuff. Y'all don't understand how steep this is. If I went off right there and it wasn't for the trees, it'd be like falling off a 10-story, 12-story building. Oh my gosh. Golly. Camera will never do that justice. Uh-oh, where are we going? I'm down. Let's see it. I got no clue where this takes us, but we're going. Oh! Oh boy, so we're about to go down this trail. It says warning, most difficult. Hopefully we'll get into something good. I'm about over the trail ride. I'm about ready to show y'all some real shit. We just took a little lunch break, ate some snacks. One of the guys in our group, they went out to get gas and got pulled over and got a reckless driving ticket, dude. And from the sound of it, like he wasn't even being reckless. He says he's got it all on camera, but he's gonna come back and fight it. So apparently these cops are bad out here, man. This is pretty steep. I think we're solid. Woohoo! It's like a roller coaster going down this joint. Holy cow, dude. That's steep. Holy crap, dude. But this stuff right here, isn't this a double black diamond? Yeah, this is like a double black diamond, something crazy. Oh, I'd rather be going up this. Holy, Holy shit. Holy shit, All dude. Right, the goggles are coming off. I gotta be able to see everything. I have never done any rock crawling or hill climbing with this X3, and I'd like to kind of get introduced into it this weekend. Hatfield McCoy Trails, it's the place to do it, man. So I want to kind of get into it. More as a play thing, I don't want to destroy nothing, but uh, we're probably going to do some crazy shit you guys know me i'll jump right into something and go as hard as i can at it other than dirt bikes on a track i've just never been good at that i've tried okay yeah this is my kind of shit right here in the x3 if we're not going super fast and hitting jumps and stuff what i like doing is going slow and being like very particular and on that verge of dying pretty fun i'm telling you if we can complete this whole trail that sign saying it's the hardest trail out here i'm gonna be very disappointed i think this trail we're supposed to go the other way on bro going up this would be a whole different scenario Oh, we hit the skid plate. Oh my God. We're sitting pretty tall when we hit the skid plate. This stuff's bad, man. I definitely feel like this trail was designed to be hit from the other way though. Oh my goodness. We just keep on with these insane downhills. Oh my gosh. You fall into that, you might roll it. Holy crap. Now this is the kind of stuff you need harnesses for. This is crawling, baby. It's actually just riding the brakes. <laughs> going down, everything's a lot easier than going up it. We might have to turn around and hit this trail going the other way. Nothing's yet to have sketched me out to where I'm like, no, I don't want to do that. That kind of, that might might be it. Oh my gosh. It looks not as bad from this angle. We're just gonna roll over it real quick and hope for the best. I didn't want to do that slow. Feel like there's more chance of rolling going slow. Keep that momentum rolling forward. It doesn't want to tip up as much. You want to turn around and go up it? Hey, let, let Christian hop in with you and you drop them up at like the hard parts. Yeah, this is a different riding style like this, dude. This should be fun. I might as well go ahead and throw her in four wheel drive. Oh my gosh. It looks so bad going this way. This looks so much worse. Holy cow, bud. I was more comfortable going down that. This shit is steep, son. Oh my gosh. I really don't think I even talked going up that hill. Guess I was trying to concentrate. That shit was steep, dude. Hope I clear that rock. Looks like we cleared it. Man, it would suck to roll one of these things down a mountain. I kind of want some more intense rock crawling though. Like, I feel like we're supposed to be spinning all four, but it's kind of just crawling through. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Bro, that is so steep. Oh my gosh. This is ridiculous. Yo, these X3s will go up anything, bro. This might be a rough one. Oh my gosh. No way. I know it looks flat to you guys. My neck's gonna hurt tomorrow from looking up so much. Lower and low, and I guess we're gonna go up it. The camera's not gonna do this shit justice. Oh my gosh, this is sketchy. All fours are spinning. Oh, it went through though. 
Shit's crazy. So much steeper going up it. Holy cow. When I first seen the first one, I was like, no shot, bro. I spun all fours one time for maybe a full rotation, but that was it. Nobody flipped, nobody died, nobody rolled. So let's go harder, baby. It's so crazy how it can go so low speed, turn all the tires, and it's so spot on. And then you just stomp on it, and it's just woo. Oh my gosh. Should I do it in two wheel? We're going to try in two wheel. <laughs> I can't believe it. I can't believe it. He's spinning in two wheel. He can't make it up that in two wheel. Come on, Landon. Now that we kind of got the part figured out, it's just a matter of time. One of us gets arrested. One of us flips and rolls. Airlifted out of here in a helicopter. I'm not trying to jinx it. I'm just saying. It can only get crazier from here. Oh, oh. We're just going to start in it. How about that? Oh, I felt the back end pick up. Oh, my gosh. What if your brakes went out? It'd be ridiculous. You'd die. Can you imagine? falling off that look how steep that is you can't even look up it's like you look up and it's as high as you can see it's just freaking trees don't roll it 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 i can't see what we're doing but if he did it i can do it just send it oh my goodness bro if we would have fell right it's instant death bro ride the rut jesus uh-oh what the hell is this he's about to fall into it dude dude he might he might roll it there, there ain't no other move. It's either in the rut or nothing. You just gotta ride the wall and hope it doesn't roll. If he can do it, we can do it. It's muddy too, which ain't good. Yeah, the wall will catch us right now. We made it. The camera doesn't do it justice. I can't believe we just went down that. Could you imagine if your machine broke down down here? Could you imagine if we were trying to go the other way though? I swear we keep hitting them backwards. See, if there was a Sasquatch, it could definitely get away without being seen by nobody in West Virginia. It's endless shit of just big mountains like this. Nobody's walking these mountains. Nobody knows what's actually happening out here dude but at some point they had to have some kind of what the hell did he just go down they had to have some kind of something to make these trails holy crap see how it's just like the dirt's edged out i just don't think that happened over the years but it could have hope the trail ain't over this is a kick-ass one we need more of that that was nice i like that are the other guys behind you yeah yeah i don't hear their motors yo he flipped he rolled it damn it Oh shit. Holy shit. I was worried about that happening. Put her back in four wheel drive. Where did he roll at? He ran all that way to come get us. Because where's the side by side? Well, there he is. Yeah, he look, he's walking. He ran all that way. How far up? No way. No, that's going to be bad. He ran all that way? Landon will pick him up. He's got a spare seat. Bro, I can't believe he ran that far. I was worried about them not being behind us. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are you okay? Just hanging around. You're just hanging around? Did wheelchair make it? Yeah, wheelchair's fine. You rolled from up there. Yeah. Okay, this is going to be tricky. This is going to be super tricky. Do you want out? No, I'm just you, hanging around. You're just, you're just hanging out? Yeah, you know. What else, what else am I going to do with no legs? Oh, uh, you got one hell of a son. He ran on a hell of a way to get to us. I know. I was, I was yelling for you guys. After we came around down there, I was like, all right, is he behind us? Oh my gosh. I should. We should have waited here for you. Was it already falling this road? It just kind of tipped over. He must have bounced off this wall. He just slowly fall, fell over off the wall. Your car should be fine. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'd like to get you flipped over, but this is going to be a tricky one. Yeah, if you go around a tree, this ain't a good spot. Yeah, bro, you ran a long way. You're committed. I guess he had no other option. So he didn't roll off there somehow tipped over right here holy cow dude oh gosh it is slick as well snot when he said it was at this spot i was worst case scenario just start her up put her in four wheel start digging <laughs> did you film it my, my GoPro got dead. It. you got it no shit hey what's your what's the channel name b and s adventures i hope i don't slide under this thing and fucking get crushed <laughs> two three uh, one two three <laughs> <sighs> Holy shit. Yeah, I haven't rolled mine yet. Maybe I'll roll mine tomorrow. Hey, put her in park or hold the brake. Yeah, that, that's going to be... It's still not going to want to sit. Hope it didn't break nothing. It might have broke something. If you hit the key, it won't turn on, but it'll... uh. Give you power steering. There you go. I let some out. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, we're about solid. It'll sit like that. All right, front end. I think that's good. Yeah, that front end looks pretty solid. Front end looks kind of solid. I was worried about it. Hold the brakes. and going to disconnect it. This is crazy, man. Uh, It's kind of towards the right, like you're turning left. I think it looks fine, but I'd drive it to see if it is. Somebody had to roll today. Now we don't know if somebody's going to roll tomorrow. We were talking about turning around and going that way out of here. But that, that hill 
looks so steep. Oh my gosh. It's a little smoky. She'll burn out a little bit. She'll be fine. So a lot of people wonder, and the first time this ever happened to me, we rolled over my parents' golf cart. I'm sorry, mom, if you're watching this. We rolled it over and then it just, we started it back up and it started puffing smoke. But what happens is when you turn a motor upside down, the, the piston rings, they can't keep that oil from going into the top end. It definitely slows it down, but oil's still gonna get into the top end. And so then it just burns off white, but you know, it's solid. As long as it's not a whole lot where it bends a valve or something. You're ready to rock, baby. So uh, I don't know if we're gonna, how we're gonna turn around or what we're gonna do, but we, uh, we're gonna scoot back that away. Oh my, did it break the windshield? Oh my gosh, that's some crap. Man, that was crazy. I'm glad he's okay, dude. So that's actually Sean's dad. And uh, I think he's paralyzed from the waist down. His hand controls like this. We gotta get a shot of it later or tomorrow. Insane, and he drives it like a pro. It's crazy. You would never, He, I think he pushes for brake and uses his thumb for gas and drives with this hand. Dude, you would never even realize it. He's a great driver with that shit, it's crazy. Oh man, I don't know where we're headed to now. Now you can't ride in West Virginia on the Hatfield McCoy trails. You can ride the outlaw trails at night, which is private property that trails are built on by the landowner and that allow everyone to ride. But you can't do it on all these public trails. I think we're gonna start this long trek back. We'll probably get into some more shit, maybe roll another side by side. But uh, we got a long ways back to camp so we can grill some burgers and eat some grub, baby. It is crazy dude like you do not want to come out here by yourself if you get lost or hurt out here you're done it is definitely a place to go and never be seen again you're out here in the middle of nowhere son now today is definitely a preview of what you guys are going to be seeing tomorrow tomorrow's ride that is going to be next level i mean we're going to all run through two tanks of gas in these machines we're just kind of getting a feel for everything making sure nothing's going to break before we go out on our long hike we'll grill up our burgers and start eating burgers tonight and then what we'll do is while we're eating is we'll plan we'll have the whole map planned out where we want to go what trails we want to hit how to be the most efficient this is really just us riding around and uh, trying to have a good time and see what we can get into bro look at the sun we're on the back side of the mountain now it's about to be sunny what the hell daylight to dark just like that i don't even need my headlights anymore i miss the sun this makes me want to keep riding <laughs> oh you gotta love it oh look out we're flying bro we have gotten off this mountain quicker and shit back onto the pavement baby so cool being able to drive pavement all the way back to your cabin like i said the whole state's a riding park i love to cut some fat donuts right here oh yeah baby we are made it back let's put these suckers up and hop out for a second oh boy look at me i am a muddy wreck this place actually check it out it has an outdoor shower super sick i'm probably gonna hop in that thing right away how was the ride you have fun hanging awesome, awesome i just dog. hang around all day long <laughs> waiting for us to pull you over huh <laughs> you know. christian dog what do you think about trail around this is your first time ever in west virginia yeah no i had a blast dude blast that, i think this is my type of ride really yeah you think it's it i think so. I cannot wait to take you to Durmtown. I'm excited. You are going to love that. <laughs> now, considering the rolling that X3 is the only thing we did today, tomorrow is going to be crazy. No one's scared of nothing yet. We're going to map it out, what we're doing tomorrow, and absolutely kick ass. It's going to be so much fun. We're in West Virginia, baby. We got one more video coming out here, and uh, it's going to be super sick. So if you enjoyed this one, subscribe and stay around for the second one. It's going to be crazy. But if you guys would, go ahead. First link in the description, if you guys want to help support me. You guys literally been killing the merch. I love love you guys for it. You guys don't understand how much it actually means to me seeing you guys buy my shirts and wear them. So if you guys want to help support, first link in the description, you guys have been killing it. Guys, if you would, hit the thumbs up on this video, like and subscribe, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. Yeah.